Hi, welcome to Conversations Matter with me, Heather Criswell. I'm so thankful that you showed up to watch this video. I had a really amazing conversation that I think will help you along the way as well. So I met with a new client of mine. He is interested in some business strategy sessions. And so we sat down, went over everything that he wanted to do, what he was looking for, and he brought out all his demographics, all his research, his two-year plan, his five-year plan. And I looked at him and I said, what if life has a bigger dream for you than that you can even imagine in this moment? And he looked at me kind of funny like I was crazy because he is looking, he's actually working his stable job for the next two years so that he can build this company. And I said, but what if life has the opportunity for you to get out of the job that you're in right now and do this full time next month? What about that? Because when we shut the door on the possibility, our destiny tends to lay out two years down the road. So it was a new, fresh perspective I could tell for him. And it reminded me of a keynote speech that I do where it's called, it's called Life Has a Bigger Dream for You Than a Dyson Vacuum. And I talk about how I had a vision board where a vision board is where you put a bunch of things that you want and love to manifest into your life. And so I put talking to Oprah, tons of money, being on a beach in Mexico, all of these things. And with that, I also put a Dyson vacuum. And after quite some time, I started realizing that the more I looked at this vision board, the more I realized things weren't showing up for me in the time that I wanted them to. And I also noticed that we did get a Dyson vacuum and I just looked around and I thought, is this it? Really? This is, this is it? A Dyson vacuum? Granted, Dyson vacuums are awesome, I'm not gonna lie. Total dis, we've had it 20 years, it's an amazing vacuum. But I thought to myself, is this it, really? And what I realized is I needed to ditch the vision board and let the universe, God, spirit, whatever that external power is, show up for us in ways that we couldn't even imagine. Surprise us with amazing things that were like, how did that even happen? How did that show up? It happened with me when I was launching both my businesses. My, when I launched my preschool, my dad out of the blue came to me. I was working at MGM Grand in their youth center and he came to me and said, there's a preschool for sale. You wanna go look at it? I was like, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? When we opened um, the wellness center, there was a building that we were gonna build out, invest about $100,000. And then this other building showed up and it was perfect. We just literally moved in for nearly nothing. So the universe has a way of giving us exactly what we need or want if we're just open to it. So he is super excited about all the possibilities and I hope that you are excited about all the possibilities and that we don't limit ourselves to what we believe we can achieve. But if not this, then something more, something better in my highest good. That's the mantra that I say because life is full of surprises. And I'll tell you, when I get something I expect, it's way less fun than something that totally surprises me, totally sends me into another space. I got a phone call from a media company that said, look, we found you on YouTube and we're interested in you doing kind of a super nanny thing for a television show. And I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, you found me on YouTube with all 28 subscribers. And he's like, yeah, we actually did. You never know what is possible. And while that didn't work out because it wasn't really my kind of thing, um, reality TV, I went through the whole process. I was open, but it just wasn't my thing. But what I will say is I never in a million years thought that was possible. And what if life has a bigger dream even than Oprah? I don't even know if that's possible, but I will tell you. What if life has a bigger dream for me than even Oprah? Being open and ready to, to show up. So that's the lessons that I've learned and remembered today in this conversation with him is that 
You never know the possibilities. You never know what's right around the corner for you. You never know what life has in store for us. And surprise me, surprise me with beautiful, amazing things, things that I could never expect. So I hope you all have a beautiful day and realize that conversations matter. Every conversation matters. And conversations rooted in love and possibility change everything. I love you all so much. Mwah. Bye.